the artifact of the gatekeeper one of the three artifacts you will need to find on scorched earth if you want to take on the manticore boss so let's get straight into it so i'm going to show you where i'm now this isn't where the cave is we've got to go and travel to the cave but i don't want you getting lost you can just stay there a moment please alpha so we are at the corner it's exactly 63 44 what you look for is this little structure here and that's our first spot so if i get on the dire wolf we are rocking three dire wolves today at uh, four dire wolves today sorry uh all with these have got he's got 6k 350 the rest have got about 4k 300 melee just to give you stats we're rocking full desert armor a normal shotgun normal crossbow some grapples because there are some jump bits we may need to do some health potions Cactus broth to keep us cool, and then some lesser antidote in case we get bitten by a bat. So as you can see right there, there is a explorer note if you want to grab that one. I'm not going to at this moment in time. But yes, we have to travel to the cave because the cave is actually in this canyon. As you can see, you can get in here with flyers. But obviously, because the cave we're going into is so low to the... The entrance to the cave that we're going into is quite small, so you're going to have to use creatures like direwolves, sabers, raptors, that kind of thing, because big stuff like mantises can only get about halfway. Uh, and then also like filers can only get halfway as well. So what we're going to do is literally just going to come here, follow it down to the right. And then we should see the ramp up here now. Make sure we don't lose anyone. Oh, run into a rock. We go here, and we're going to go left up here. Yeah, for this, we're going to get to this device, and we're going to go right through this little tunnel. Have we lost one? We have lost one. Where's he gone? Alright, make sure everyone's still following you, don't lose any of them. And we're going to get to this point over here, walk across this little bridge. Make sure they're definitely still following. Come up left here. And here we are at the entrance. Like I said, it's a very small entrance. A dire wolf can easily get in. So sabers, raptors, that kind of thing will also get in with very, very, very much ease. Yes, with ease. Uh, a mantis can get in if you want to use a mantis for this half. But then there's a second half where you won't be able to use a mantis. What we're going to do is just going to follow this cave down. Make sure we've still got these guys behind us. We are in the old tunnels. That's what this cave's called. So you've got your first split here. It uh, doesn't really matter which way you go. They both end up in the same place. But I go right. So let's head right. Make sure you guys are still with me. Now you're going to find all the cr creatures in this cave. All your normal cave creatures. You're going to find mantis, vultures. Uh, stuff like megalania. I think megalosauruses may be able to spawn in this cave as well. So luckily we are in daytime. So we shouldn't have to deal with them. It's pretty quiet so far. Which is kind of scary. Also, there's a chance a rubble golem will be in the cave. Obviously, if there is that, we don't have the equipment to take it out. Because you'll need like rocket launchers and stuff like that. So if we see one of them, we are running for our life. There we go. We're at this point now. This is when you'll start to probably see some creatures. We're going to have to follow this bridge across. As we pass the... Uh, obelisk hieroglyph, I guess. It's kind of not really a hieroglyph, is it? I'm going to come up here. Everyone's still chilling? Yeah. Cool, cool, cool. Let's make sure we're on neutral. And we're going to head on down. And just sort of get into a little bit of a fight now. Make sure we get boosted. Should have probably done that before we ran in. Uh, just keep going straight forward and then we're going to get to this point here. Now this is the second point which starts to get small. So this, if you did bring a mantis, your mantis won't be able to fit through here. Your wolf will, just about. See how tight that is? Uh, I knew we were going to lose one. Just park in there real quick. Grab the fourth one. Now if you did just spot it before I went, there is a Rockwell record right there. I don't know why... Alpha started to walk off. So I'll pick that up if you want. Then we get to this point. 
Sorry, I had to burp then. Uh, excuse me, right. Sorry, I had to burp. We're going to go left here at this divide because right is a drop. So let's not drop into hell, shall we? Have these guys following. We walk past all these creepy crypts. Then we're going to get to here. And at this point, we're going to actually be able to see the artifact all the way down there. That's where we've got to go. And there's plenty of stuff in between there and us. Now, what we're going to do is we're probably going to have to leave the walls here. Because we're going to have to do some jumping. And I don't think they're going to be able to follow us all the way. See how far they can follow us first. There definitely is a jump coming up. Ah, here it is, yeah. So you get to about here. Then we have to jump across this little area. Okay, that wolf was starting to just jump into the floor. So what we're going to do is we're going to have to whistle them away. Now there is that hole down there. You can drop down there. It's not like um, the... Which cave is it? The Artifact of the Crag Cave. No, sorry, the Artifact of the Destroyer Cave. It's not like that one where there's a death drop. Obviously, you jump down there, you'll be okay. You'll probably get fairly injured, but you'll be okay. No, actually, what we will do, just to make my life a little bit easier, is we'll drop down here with the wolves, and then I'll just jump them all back across later. Whee! Let's bring them all down. Then we're going to head on down towards the artifact. But it's pretty easy. It's not too bad to get lost. Um, obviously, there's a couple of different directions. But it's not too bad. Can, can you not be in the way, please, wolves? Just follow it around. And now you're going to get to here. And we're literally at the artifact now. You can continue down there uh, towards... I believe there is a drop down there sometimes. I wouldn't risk it though. I think it is. It's definitely down there. We're going to come across here and we act the artifact. So I'm going to quickly just uh, pause the video for a sec so I can take a thumbnail. I'll be back in one moment. All right, there we go. So I've taken my uh, thumbnail now. So let's go grab it. You get the artifact of the gatekeeper as well as the Scorch Spike skin, which is to put on your spear or your pike. That's why it's called a spike. Where? Why? Why are you down there? Ah, okay. I guess. So you're just going to basically come back the way you came. Obviously, you're going to have to redo that jump. I'll do for video's sake I will come back for the wolves later I'll just get us out of here first and come back from after so we're here at our jump this one follow so jump across the first one be careful jump across the second one like that obviously pretty easy and we just head back up the ramp Obviously, be careful not to fall off the edge. I'll be a bit very stupid out here. Get back to the crypts. Obviously, we get to this point. Just basically, just keep following the crypts now. So you can see that's where the explorer was there. This is where that second tunnel was. Head towards the blue. Hello, Mantis. How are you? Go left when we get there. Past the sulfur rocks. And keep on heading up. Then go left across this little path. Past the artifact uh, obelisk thing. Picture. Put it down. I got some spiders spawning in. You want to go straight through the middle here. Follow it round. Follow it round. Nice and easy. We get to this point. You're going to go left. We should be literally at the exit now. There we are. So that is the artifact of the gatekeeper. The exact coordinates for the entrance is 58.847.7, just in case you want to know. And there you go. So if you need to know about any of the other artifacts, I have done videos on them. So go and check them out on the channel. Yeah, enjoy Scorched Earth.